Now, some of you may or may not know that there's also a sum of a difference, uh, sum of the square of a difference. So the only thing that is different in when you have a minus sign and of an a plus b quantity squared is your answer is gonna have a negative sign or a minus sign before your second term. So we can still use the same shortcut where we take our first term and square it. And then in the middle, we take two times a negative b, which is negative two b. Negative two b times an a, which gives you negative two ab. And then for your third term, you just square that. So we're going to find our square here. We're gonna take three c and we're gonna square it. So three times three is a nine c squared. Your middle term is two times a negative four, which is a negative eight. Negative eight times three, which is a negative 24 c. And then your last term is just negative four squared or 16. I love me some shortcuts. That is how you find the square of a difference using the shortcut.